Hello and welcome to Only In Your Mind. My name is Natasha and this week is my last video for my Spongebob collection face paint. It is Gary. If you guys want to see how I did his face paint, just keep watching. We are starting off with this photo that I found of Gary online and the Fusion palette from Leanne and it is Leanne's Happy Pixie Pastel Palette. We're starting with this blue combination that she has for the background of um, Gary and I'm just going to put that all on my forehead and on the sides of my forehead as well and then I'm using this one here with the yellow at the corner of my eyes for the top of my eyelids I'm gonna put some of that yellow right there on the bridge of my nose then I'm gonna clean up the edges here and then we're gonna go ahead and start with um, a nice pink color and this one I think is a tag it's a neon pink so I'm gonna go ahead and make the shell of um gary so to tell you the truth i am not positive that this is a tag color but any pink will do what happened is i depotted a lot of my plain colors to make one big palette so when i go face painting it's so much easier to have all the colors lined up and it's basically all my mayron colors but a couple of colors i really liked and i just put them in that palette so now that i'm done with kind of what i want with the shell i'm gonna use um kind of like a bright blue from mayron and i did the bottom of his i don't know body and then i'm gonna do his face right here this is part of his head and right around here i'm gonna go around and that's gonna be um, his mouth and I'm leaving the area for his teeth open so I could just add the white and here are his um, What do you call those tentacles? Yeah, so there's his tentacles right there and Then I'm gonna go ahead and go in and do the tops of his eyelids you can't really tell on top of those other colors, but like I said before I have a palette that um I have all my colors mixed and I have a light blue within that little area with my um, medium blue so that's a come that blue for the eyelids look a little bit different and now I'm using a lime green from Mayron in here and that's for the bottom of his little I don't know area at the bottom of his body and here is his eyeballs and they are the same green as the bottom of his little slimy parts there we go and I'm just gonna go ahead and redo his eyelids looks a lot lighter but it's okay so here is the white that I am using and it is from wolf for his teeth there we go and now I'm gonna put some glitter on his eyeballs so now it's time to highlight the inner corner of my eyes with some white. I'm using Mayron White. And then I'm going to go ahead and do a swooping line all the way across to the other side. I'm going to blend out that white. I'm going to use Wolf Black to do some eyelining work. And with this wonderful stencil and dauber that I love so much, I'm going to go ahead and put all these dots all over in the background of gary i'm going to put some on the bridge of my nose and on the corner of my eyelids then with another stencil and it's from the uh, graffiti eye pack which is the same stencil here and it's like squares that go from smaller all the way to larger i'm going to use the same pink that i use for his shell and some pink glitter and do it on the corner of his face so this design and my other design i thought it was missing a little something so i decided to go ahead and add almost like little butterfly wings at the bottom and then i went ahead and did a swirl at the top coming from the corner of my eyes and did one two teardrops and then a little swirl here and then one two three teardrops pointing to the middle of my eyes and then kind of like did a little bit of dots everywhere and did of course his eyelids again because they keep fading into the color and then I'm using a red to do the swirl inside of the shell and it's from Mayron so I'm using some Mayron purple and adding some dots to his shell as well 
And then for his eyes, I'm using some orange from Mehron. And those are his little pupils here. And then I'm going to go in with some black from Wolf for in the middle. And then when I'm done with his um, dots in the middle of his eyes, I'm going to start doing some line work. And then we're going to start seeing him pop out from the background and kind of like come to the front of the actual design. So here we go. So guys, I really did enjoy doing characters from SpongeBob to make like a series of face paints. And uh, I thought that was really cool. And I forgot that I did that before. I did Pokemon and I did um, some football. And I want to say I did basketball teams. I'm not positive, but I think I did. And they're like little series. So I really do enjoy doing that. And I think I'm going to go ahead and look for more cartoons that I think I can do characters from. But if you guys did enjoy that, you know, leave it in the comments below if you want to see more uh, character series type face paints but maybe I can also do something like um, maybe showing you my face painting kit because that was one of the things I thought would be pretty cool so here I'm gonna go ahead and line Gary with some wolf white and yeah I thought it would be pretty cool because I always like looking at other people's face painting kits and I really haven't um, done much face painting outside of my house I did a couple of gigs but it would be pretty cool so maybe I'll do something like that if you guys think that you would like to see what I actually um, use and what my face painting kit looks like I have one that I use when I just face paint at home and then I have a kit that I actually go out and face paint kids with so if you guys want to see that just let me know in the comments below so I'm going to add some Starburst here. Here we go. So I'm going to add some more Starburst. I'm going to line underneath my eye with some white. Add some um, little highlights around Gary. Do some more line work um, on the bottom of Gary. Add some lipstick. And of course add some wonderful glitter around this awesome design. And I would like to thank you guys, as always, for checking out my videos. And like I said, please leave me a comment below and tell me if you would like to see more cartoon characters or if you would like to see my face painting kits. Or just leave me a comment. Let me know how you're doing. Thank you again. You guys are awesome, as always. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I did my very last face paint in my Spongebob collection series. Um, of course, this is Gary. Here is Gary, the crochet creation. And if you wanna check out all the other videos that I have from Spongebob, I'll put the link in my description box below to check out those. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this face paint of Gary. And if you did, leave me a like if you want. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I really do appreciate all your time that you spend with me checking out my videos. And, um, you know, I really do appreciate you guys. It is Mother's Day weekend. Happy Mother's Day. God bless. And I'll see you guys on my next video.